So, woke up early. Had to uh, drive Luna to the vet. Is she okay? I'd like to think so. I'd like to hope so. She's got some, she's got heart valve disease and she's got a heart murmur, but she's a fighter. So we're gonna go, there's nothing much she, they can do for her today. So she's gonna go to the cardiologist tomorrow. And um, you know, she's just going through those old lady, old lady things, heart problems and pooping and peeing herself. Whoops. No. I'm not going to put her in Depends. I'm going to let her keep her dignity. But we'll see how it goes for her. I'm still hopeful. I know that everything's okay. So Luna's on the up and up. She's back home after the second round at ER. I'm going to be honest and say that I was like 25% like, holy shit, is this it? Is this the end? And then 75% of me was like, no, Luna's a fighter. Fuck this. This isn't happening. Mm -mm, not having it. It's just pulling through so hard. Like, I've been solid. 75 25 i'm leaning now towards 80 20 but we're gonna see she took she's been taking her medicine the stronger she gets the more i'm gonna believe in her and i know she's gonna believe in herself you know that's all you can ask for somebody recovering from a, somebody as old as luna from a heart condition she's she's doing the damn thing thankful. You just, just gotta keep staying positive. That's all I can do. It could go either way. But positivity will give me some time with Luna. Give her time with the family. We can all experience her to the fullest. She can go peacefully. Not at the ER. Who wants to go there? It, Luna's gonna survive. She's thriving.